Hey friends and wine lovers, how are you? Mark Supsik here, Certified Wine and Spirits Professional on behalf of Wine Still Sold Out. As we shift towards warmer weather, many of us find ourselves drinking more light white wines and rosés as well. But I know that a lot of you red wine lovers out there have a really hard time making that change. I mean, there's really no substitute for a big, bold red wine, is there? Well, today I'm going to offer three possible suggestions. These are white wines for the red wine lover. So my experience tells me that people who drink red wines usually do so for several key reasons. First factor is that they love big, full-bodied wine that often feels rich, creamy, or silky when you drink it. They usually prefer the toasty, woody, or smoky aspect of a barrel-aged wine. They like high alcohol wines, which tend to be denser, heavier, and comforting. And they prefer lower acidity. Wines that tend to feel a little bit more round and smooth and don't necessarily give you that heartburn that you get from white wines. So with those basic guidelines in mind, here are three white wines that I think fit the bill. The first off is Pinot Blanc from Alsace. Pinot Blanc is kind of a mystery to most wine drinkers, or I should probably say most wine drinkers don't even know that it exists. It comes from France, in this case Alsace, which is a region on France's eastern border with Germany. A Pinot Blanc is full-bodied, it's rich. Interestingly, a lot of people who drink it often describe this uh, smoky sort of aspect to it, which is really cool. And it's slightly higher in alcohol than most white wines, which makes it very thick and unctuous. So let's move on to the next wine. This grape is one of Northern Spain's best kept secrets. This is Albariño. Spanish Albariño is also very full-bodied, often described as perfumey. It's got a very fragrant aroma to it, but there's this acidity in there that keeps it nice and fresh. Now here's something very interesting about Spanish Albariño. It's often described as having a saline quality to it, meaning that it almost smells or tastes like the ocean. And for that reason, Spanish Albariño is a great partner for most seafood. And lastly, if you're a red wine drinker who likes really bold and smooth wines, you gotta try a California Chardonnay. When Chardonnay spends a lot of time aging in an oak barrel, it can take on flavors like toast, butter, butterscotch, and even bread dough. And with higher alcohol versions like the one here, they become very, very full-bodied. Here's a little pro tip for you. Big, bold, oaky California Chardonnay is actually awesome with Southern barbecue. All right, my friends, there they are. Three big, bold, and beautiful white wines that I think a lot of you red wine drinkers out there would really love. If you want to buy any of these wines that you see here, or really anything for wines still sold out, don't forget to use my special discount code. Plug in the code MARK, that's MARK with a C, and you'll get $10 off any order of $50 or more. Thanks so much for joining me today. I hope you learned something. On behalf of Wines Still Sold Out, I'm Mark Sopsik. Cheers.